Hello friends, family, and fans. I'm Hotter D, and we are back playing Horizon Zero Dawn. So last time we made it to the Eclipse's base, we're looking for a tall neck, or at least the head of a tall neck, because we found its legs, just no head. Weird. Anyways, and we learned a bit more about uh, Helios, which apparently he's crazy and weird and a fanatic, you know, the usual stuff. So we're sneaking through the base, there's bombs going off, and it's... Yeah, let's see if we can sneak in. So, without further ado, let's jump in. Alright, here we go. As you can hear, you know, lots of stuff. You know what? Uh, outfits. Where's my sneaking outfit? There we go. Sneak. Perfect. Uh, do I have any better sneak? 5% stealth. 5%. No, it doesn't look that way. Nope. That's as best sneaking as I can get. There we go. Oh, oh, what is that? Oh! Alert! Irregular transmission source detected. Oh. Alright. Cool. Okay. Yeah, I definitely feel exposed. Well, at least there's no one here. That's always a benefit. What is this? Is this bones? I don't know. I can't really tell. It looks like bones, but at the same time, it's like... There's no creatures that are big enough for these bones to I fit. See it. They've built some kind of structure around Yeah, I see that. Climb it. The sooner this is done... Oh my better. Jesus, shut I up. I like this. It feels wrong. Everything here is wrong. Just get to the module and destroy it. Okay, yeah. Gee, Sadness, you're such a great person, not completely annoying the crap out of me. Uh, okay. Wait, wait, wait a second. Uh, I think I went the wrong way. <laughs> ah, let's try going this way. Tall neck still alive? Wait, are the machines alive? I don't know! I don't know if I should feel bad for the machines now that I think about it. There we go. Simple. And now we're gonna be a uh, I see the module. Good. Now be quick. Oh. This is Hades. Aloy, this is not the time. It's a metal devil. Open the module's casing now. Aloy, do as I say or all is lost. All right, all right. I mean... Ow! Dicks! That's Hades. Entity has come here. Uh-oh. Entity miscalculated. Entity cannot destroy me. I am beyond its reach. Uh, maybe you are, but this isn't. Ooh, hey, yo! <laughs> destroy the entity. Oh, what is that? That is a problem. Uh oh. Oh, poop, 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 poop. Yeah. Wee. Oh, there goes the tall neck. I like the tall neck. Maybe it's because it's the only thing in this world tr not trying to kill me. Keep running. Okay. Uh, 
Check. And, uh, oh. uh, yep. I'm almost out of it. Whee! Ugh, what? Roll, don't fight. Okay, jeez, okay. We're moving, we're moving, we're moving. Don't look at me, don't look at me, don't look at me. Woo! Don't look Are at me, don't look at me. Are you kidding me? me. Okay. Alright guys, hold on, I gotta plug in my controller. Apparently battery's low. Last thing I need is my battery dying while I'm trying to escape. Alright. Whoop. There we go. Yeah, wrap that around there. Much better. Okay. Ah! Whee! Almost there. Ah! Ow! That was a big Yeah, Whee! I noticed. Ah! Oh, I didn't strike the bump up like I wanted to. More clips across the ravine. Yeah, yeah, I see them, I see them, I see them, I see them. Hi, how's it going? Uh, really great to see you, and uh, hey, guess what? Whee! Oh! At least there was water down below. In case of emergencies. Ow. Water hurts. Let's put, it, let's put it that way. I still love my blue gleam necklace. Well, I just crashed her entire uh, focus system. Who knows how long that thing's been operational? Excuse me. I've literally had one hour of sleep in. Definitely over 24 hours. Rough going, but you survived. You knew Hades was there and you sent me to him? Yes. I won't deny I risked your life, but it was the only way. Now, with the focus network down, we can both get what we want. Access to the secrets of Zero Dawn. I'm past trusting you with secrets. Yeah, it's kind of a dick. Good. That means you're wising up. Trust is for fools. It shifts and crumbles like sand. A poor foundation for any partnership. But mutual self-interest. Now that is a solid bedrock upon which you and I might build a new science of understanding. I'm gonna stab this guy. We both need answers, Aloy. And thanks to you, we're on the verge of grasping them. It's unfold. We'll speak again. I love that he like turns and walks Jeez, out of my out of my like projection. Alright, there we go. If I could toss this focus and be rid of you, Simons, I would. But we both know I need it. Yes. That's all it is. And zero dawn. I've literally had this focus for like a long part of my life. Oh my jeez. Yeah, you really think I'm gonna like take a horse back over here? Hell no. All right, um, let's, uh, let's go here. Oh. Fast travel. That's right, because, <laughs> like, heck, if I'm going all that way on horseback. It may be a pretty game, but I don't have that much time. There you go, do a little dance on the way. Hmm, wow. He has a... As I was saying earlier, like, you know, I've got like an hour power nap after I was done work. And then I was up all day. So, winning! But, still find enough energy to record. Plus, I've been looking forward to this all week, because, like I said, I always record at night, and now that I work at night, I don't really have much recording time. Alright. Ah, come on, hurry up. There we go. Ooh. Why, hello? Uh, alright. Not too much already. I guess I just reached level 52. Ah, I have skills I can spend. Alright, let's be your attack. Uh, let's uh, scavenger. Increased chance for extra resources when looting. I don't need extra resources. <laughs> Dismount strike. I don't want that either. Um, let's see. Repair mount. Machine repair. Increase mount health and repair speed. I don't care. 
Repair every overridden machine. Repair a damaged amount using metal shards. Gather resources and search and down enemy. Ah. Alright, looks like I'm doing this. There you go. Sometimes I like to swing my, uh. Sometimes I like to swing my, uh. Spear at things. Alright. And now that we're done with that, it's back to my, uh. Wear account. Come to me, beast. I do find it funny that I always summon, like, a, a broadhead. Like, I never really actually summon anything else. Alright, how do I get down from here? There's a glowy thing over there that I don't want to mess with. And, oh, look, more glowy things that I don't want to mess with. A uh, broadhead. Maybe a little bit quicker, please. There we go. Ah, the wasteland. Exactly where I wanted to be. It's full of waste and land. Uh, Tramper, do you mind not being on a on the road? Thank you. It'd be fascinating if they weren't looking for me. There we go. Campfire discovered. Is this sunfall? Looks pretty uh, dark and depressing. Not gonna lie. I'm sorry, you want me to do what? There's all these enemies in front of it. Like, that's a lot of enemies. That's not something that can't get me. Oh, good. There we go. There we go. Perfect. Save. And then jump back in. Nope. That's not what I wanted. And then jump back in. I don't know how much longer this game is. Alright. Sunfall. The Mad King Drown Summer Palace. A bold work of cards you might have given time. Thanks for the history lesson. But they have no idea what lies beneath. We will learn much from this Aloy. That's what I'm hoping. Alright. Oh, look, there's some, uh, side quests over there, but, uh, we don't need that. So, these are the, like, the, uh, these are the, uh, the Karja that were on the side of, uh, the Mad King. So, He's always been a righteous man. He's been a righteous man. With Uthid gone, Sunfall feels even less safe. Well, I think this place is safe for anyone. So, what do you got? Anything new? Nope. 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 Anything here? Uh, nope. 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 All right. Cool. All right. Uh, as per usual, let's get a free sample box. There you go, roll around, and yeah, I'm not Banuke at all, I don't look Banuke, being in Banuke clothing and Banuke weapons. Oh, a gladiator ring, well that's cool. The subway. Alright, where do I need to hit on this thing for it to hurt? Uh, how do I... How do I... Uh, oh, okay. Uh, let's see. Uh, machine catalog. There we go. Oh. Fr Scorcher, Frost Claw, Fire Claw, Demonic Machines, Control Tower. Okay. Alright, so now, uh, Behemoth, there we go, let's see, Body, uh, Weakness, None, okay, Crate Holder, Weakness, All, oh, that's a Crate Holder, okay, Freeze Canister, Freeze and Tear, okay, uh, what are those, Force Loader, Lifting Attacks, Power Cell, just Tear, alright, good to know, good to know.
So, how's it going, guys? Don't mind me. Now we get to see if your attack on their focus network was entirely successful. What are you talking about? Did I crash the network or not? It seems all should be well. <laughs> Great. Success. Welcome to the Citadel, Aloy. I'll check back with you in a moment. In the meantime, circulate. Uh. Can I join you guys? Yeah! Super bow! Oh, you guys don't use bows? <laughs> Lame! Come on, guys. Bows are cool. Outlanders, if you want to hear about today's bounties, head for the throne room. Ooh. You're not going to make any shards by standing out here. Oh, filthy mercenary bottom feeders. I'll take the shards, even if it means having a listen to Bahab. I hear the shadow comes to the little All right. Uh, I'm going to go uh, hang out with some uh, bounty hunters. See what they have to say. There we go. Oh, who's this? Don't mind me. I'm not obvious at all. By the glory of the sun, hey, we have it. Behold, radiant Edaman, the one true sun king, the light in shadow, whose will is light and whose light is law. I command oh. the nations behind us to speak in my behalf. I the inner king. By the will of Radiant Edaman does the sun glare down mercilessly upon the traitor Uthid. To the hunter who brings his head to us shall go a bounty of 500 shards. More prisoners than royalty, don't you think? Hmm. Love your hair. I know, right? Not only did the wretch conspire to you and I need to chat, Citadel, little huntress. All right. Opening tent down in Shadowside. I'll be waiting. Ooh, kind of busy. We both know you're no killer for hire. Uthid is innocent. Okay. So come see me. While there's still time to save him. So, the way in I spoke of is right behind you. You've got to be kidding. Not at all. And you needn't worry about the Kestrels. They'll be too busy acting important to pay attention to you. <laughs> First time in the Citadel, gotta see the sun ring from on high. Yeah, oh, the right. awesome. Ah, they want us to see this, boy. It makes quite an impression. Oh, Sun King's already gone. I love that the Sun King's just a little kid. It's a little like, aww. I hope we'll have a He's so such a little gaffer. Hardly. They're going to see me. You underestimate the ease of hiding in plain sight. Okay. You might not push me. You're gonna watch some the slaughter. This is the place it's a short to do drop it. From there. I don't like heights. The what? You worry me, boy. So, Head back to the throne room, worry. Outlander. You're making yourself a nuisance. Uh, excuse me. I just wanna walk. Um. Excuse me. Yeah, there we go. Just gonna. How the poop dog do you expect me to get? Oh, oh. Over here. Okay. Da da pa pa da 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 da. Whoop, whoop, whoop. <laughs> Only a Nora. Only a Nora. Wait, am I going down? And I'm going down. I was not expecting to go down. The other side of the tower. Look for a vent. Uh huh. been here before obviously no it's very important that you hear what I'm about to say okay I've shown you the way in but this humble vent marks a point of no return oh before you descend to the depths here you should be fully committed equipped and focused yeah I'm good no distractions if you have errands to run do them first or hold your peace Ooh I won't tolerate whining is that clear? Shut up. You'll tolerate what I give you. Ha <laughs> yeah! I didn't ask you along for the ride. Okay. Yeah. 
There we go. I'm heading down. I've spent a lifetime trying to uncover the secrets of this world. Whee! Where the machines came from. How the old ones achieved such marvels only to fall into silence and death. A lifetime Whee! of failure. As year by year, decade after decade, I hit walls I could not oh, break. Hey, doors what are those I could never breach. Hello. Until Honora Huntress marched out of the savage east. And voila, for her, all the deepest secrets of the earth were laid bare. I suspect you will have an easier time with this door than I did years ago. Probably. Sup, door? Hold for identity scan. Sup? Damn. Genetic profile confirmed. Entry authorized. Thank you. Malfunction. 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 Are you kidding me? You don't hear me laughing. Shut up. Hmm? There's gotta be another way. Hey! Elizabeth Sobek here! Requesting access! Access request acknowledged. Root command functions available. Do you wish to proceed? Yeah. I do! Get me through this door! Analyzing. Primary access inoperable due to mechanical failure. Wow. Emergency venting procedure likely to circumvent blockage. Do you wish to proceed? Uh, sure? Yes. <laughs> Emergency venting authorized. Oh! Oh, they're all like, this hole's having gas. I guess you can't have everything. That will draw attention. We won't have this place to ourselves for long now. Shit. We? Last I checked, I was the one whisking my life down here. Yes, fine. Now, will you please get moving? There's so much to learn in less time than I'd hoped. Yeah, sadly, we had to do the emergency open the door. The door wasn't working when I said Welcome stepped to Project Zero Dawn. Oh. Zero Dawn. We found it. So, yeah. are you really so surprised? Facility diagnostics detect multiple failures. Attempting repair. Great. So, what was this room? An entrance hall, perhaps. Have a look around. Uh-huh. I'm not doing the reading. We need support to um, da, 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 da. Oh, what, what, what is that? Uh, security containment hatch. Oh. Alright, sure. Um wait. Oh, okay. But just not. Wait, is there a dude here? Oh, okay, no, it's the wrong. I thought it was a dude. I was gonna be like, ooh, dude. Alright. Take a seat and wait for your name to be called. A selection of beverages and snacks are available. Ooh, snacks! A smaller room. I like snacks. Soundproofing. Uh, okay. Um, yeah, well, where, where's the snacks located, guys? You, you don't tempt me with snacks and then not give me snacks. Like, I need your snacks. What do we got here? Restock or else? Okay. Um, that is not scannable. Oh. Security containment hatched. What kind of hatch am I looking at? Oh, that's the main door. <laughs> Silly me. Tricks are for kids. Alright. Please proceed into viewing room one. For an important message regarding the purpose of your visit. Uh, what was this place? A holographic theater. CD01 data intact. Initiating playback. Okay. So, welcome to Project Zero Dawn. I am General Harris. Chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff of the United States of America. I'm sure you've heard the rumors. The Zero Dawn is a top secret super weapons program. The technological miracle that will save us from the Pharaoh Plague. If Operation Enduring Victory can hold off the robots long enough. Yeah. The reason I'm sure you've heard the rumors is that I'm the one who spread them. Oh. 
and they are all lies. No. Zero Dawn is not a super weapons program, and it will not save us. Well, that's a problem. Nothing will save us. And here's why. By the time the glitch was noticed, it was already too late. Nothing could stop the Pharaoh Plague. Nothing can. Its robots will continue to replicate and devour the biosphere. Life on Earth will be destroyed. Our planet reduced to a barren sphere. That's no Global good. extinction is inevitable. No matter how many we kill, the robots just keep exponentially making more. Yeah, that's the problem. Robots making if robots. If we had their deactivation codes, we could shut them all down. The entire swarm. But since their cryptographic protocols use polyphasic entangled waveforms, cracking a code set would take half a century. At best, we've got 16 months. Not exactly what you'd call a survival option. Yep. The destruction of a biosphere is not the sort of apocalypse you can wait out in a fallout shelter or a space station. There will be no Earth left to reclaim. Just a lifeless, toxic rock with several million pharaoh robots on it. Yeah. Hibernating. Waiting for something to eat. That's a problem. This is the horrible truth behind the lies of Operation Enduring Victory. My lies. Lies designed to inspire millions of innocents to sacrifice themselves in battle. Why? One reason. To buy time for you and the work you will do here. Uh oh Zero day. The day that life on Earth ceases to exist is coming fast. It cannot be stopped. The hope of Zero Dawn is that something new might come after. Oh. But I will leave it to Elizabeth Sobek to shine that thin ray of light into the darkness. Harris, out. Whoop. Okay. So the whole thing was a bunch of BS. This doesn't make sense. Life on Earth didn't cease to exist. He said it could not be stopped. But it was. Somehow, somehow Elizabeth saved us. I've, I've got to keep looking. Find out how she did it. Maybe she pooped. Maybe she pooped life into the world. She's all like, oh, I'm pooping. There's a tree. <laughs> pooping a tree. Ah, cords. All right. What do we got? What do we got? We got a uh... kestrels. They got in what? through the vents. Oh. Let nothing stop you from learning the truth. Uh, Spread out! If it moves, kill it! What is this place? Oh, that's... Crazy. Tomb? How'd they get in from the ceiling? That's what I'm wondering. I can hear you. Um, uh, to me! Let's take her down! Well, there you are. Oh yeah, just great. Bring the biggest goddamn weapon you have in here. Oh, and of course they can block my attacks as usual. Woo. Hey, guess what? My turn. Woo! Woo! The data points. What did they contain? I don't know. Give me a sec. I was busy blasting the shit out of things. Alright, let's see. Let's do this area. Ooh. some good. Where am I going? I don't actually know. Look out. Walking around. Oh. Or they just straight up opened the door for me. Okay. Okay, um but that, 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 that is a bunker door. Got it. Um data points are here. Uh thing with Suzanne Alpert, environmental scientist. Doctor? I'm sorry, I wasn't uh just stating your name. What were you thinking about, Doctor? 
Nothing the General said, not really. I was on the Syzygy East response team in 2051, just after the second earthquake compromised the reactor. I still dream about it, after all these years. That's a problem. The red zone spreading on the imaging, slowly, so slowly, like a hand opening its fingers. Your involvement in that event is why you were asked for by name. Really? That's interesting. Because nothing worked. Nothing could grow there again. It was a catastrophic failure. But the red zone is a blip compared to global scale biomass reduction. Yeah. The biosphere and hydrosphere will collapse, render the Earth uninhabitable long before the robots finish us. Enduring victory can't buy time against that. So, you'd better show me what Zero Dawn really is. Okay. Chemistry guidelines. Okay. There's a giant uh, thing in my ball. Oh, that's why. Okay, let's, uh, of course we gotta grab the gun. Yes, please. Looks with me. Fire Striker? Oh, is this one different? Alright, let's, uh, it is accurate, yes. So these mechanical monstrosities, they don't just kill people. They feed off them. Yeah. Not just people. All organic matter. Fantastic. Every living thing dissolves into nutrients. Millennia of evolution liquefied. The miracle of life reduced to bloody biofuel. In a word, yes. Uh, Who did this? Pharaoh? That asshole. Is he here? No, Doctor. Please, tell him Tom Pike wants a word. Now, get off! Get off! Uh, don't! Uh, please! You get Ted Pharaoh in here! Alright, so someone's a little upset. Um, I know what the big deal is. I mean, it's only... <laughs> he's only turned the human race and... Well, every race race and existing thing on this planet, including the planet itself, into a giant feeding tank for machines. Travis Tate. discuss? Oof. So mama, she was right. Pardon? My mother, she took her Bible real serious. Not just Texas bubble serious, Pentecostal serious. Favorite chapter? Revelation. Yeah, that's the good one. Now, I didn't always understand her on account of all that speaking in tongues and such, but when she did use her words, there was always end times this and lake of fire that on account of sinful lifestyles. Speaking of which, mind if I smoke? A tobacco cigarette. Sorry, darling. My taste run classic. Compliments your team tracked me down. Been a price on my head 18 months now. Sterling Malky was me. Don't mind admitting. Been plenty of snakesters chasing the bounty too. But I kept the zigging to their zag. How'd you finger me? Hmm? I believe Dr. Sobek listed you as an alpha candidate. Priority snatch and grab. <laughs> oh, I suspected she had a little thing for me. Hey, I don't suppose you got real coffee in this place. You know, blood coffee? Conflict cappuccinos? What? Mr. Tate, I'm clearing you to proceed. Just go. <laughs> oh, fantastic. All right. Who's this guy? Who previously worked for Pharaoh Automated Systems. On the chariot line self-replication routines. I came here thinking this was a, a rendition. When your people took me, I, I thought, about time. I've been trying to swallow the guilt every day since since uh would you like to take a moment no 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 i, I just i really hoped zero dawn was a way to undo it all my work Ooh. and i'm sorry to say i was ever proud of it but ted could really sell a concept and 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 in the labs in the the, the light of creation that first test run when when you saw they understood their own structures could rebuild themselves from memory and light. There were no limits. That is crazy. God, there were no limits. 
Yeah, that's pretty insane. No wonder that guy has absolute guilt. He designed it. But guys, we're out of time. We're going to continue our little adventure into Zero Dawn next time. Thank you so much for joining me. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Check out my other channel, Harder D Reacts. It's full of a bunch of funny little videos that I do. And until next time, you have yourself a great evening. Bye-bye.